but we are going to begin with breaking news. Vicky Latelli, whose story we first brought to you a fortnight ago tomorrow, is to be released from prison. In fact, she is being released from prison right now. Remember, she was sentenced to three years in prison for fraud. She was diagnosed with a terminal cancer inside prison. Her family have been campaigning unsuccessfully at first to get her out. Now she is going. A few minutes ago, I spoke to Ula Latelli, Vicky's uncle, at the prison. We've just been told by the regional commissioner and the director of Wurri that she can come home tonight, six o'clock. We're just packing her up now. So, so where are you, Ula? Are you at the I, prison now? I, I'm at the prison right now. A and, you right. Are, and you are there to, correct, uh, to collect Vicky? Yes, I am. And, and when did you find out this was happening? Just then? Well, just, just right now. We're, we're actually doing the afternoon visit. She's just come back from having her first um, infusion of the full strength chemotherapy. And... Um, we were just walking out to go home, and um, the, the, um, the, the the district commissioner came in, and uh, district and the director, rather, of the facility came and told uh, Vicky and us that we're just we're just praising the Lord at the moment. Without His guidance and His strength, and people like yourself, John and Bridge, that have helped us. Um, put a voice out. Uh, we've endeavoured to do everything the proper way and um, going to the media was the last resort and coming to you, John, uh, a man of uh, news but with a heart and uh, has enabled us to to do what we've enabled to enable the nation to show some compassion and some heart. And I just take my hat off to John Key and Judith Collins. Um, you know, it was a gutsy thing for them to go out the way that they did and uh, follow process and enable us to do the right thing for Vicky. Um, take her home. She's. Um, in fact, it's uh, interesting. It's almost tomorrow. It'd be two months to the day that she was told of her prognosis. And uh, her birthday's on uh, Monday, and her partner's birthday's on Sunday. So, even more poignant from the point of view that um, you know if what we're told is true. It'll be her last birthday, and we can celebrate it as a family. Ula, uh, it, it, it's two weeks tomorrow since you came to us, and and first. Uh, told us the story, and Vicky's mum, Tui, uh, first talked about uh, her predicament, her situation, and it's happened so fast, hasn't it? Because at first there was resistance and kickback, and there was no support for you, but it has gathered real momentum in the past week. And, and that's not about the media, that's about your voice, and Tui's voice, and the family's passionate advocacy for your niece and, and, and Tui's daughter. So this is a pretty magic result for you, isn't it, given the terrible, sad circumstances? It's a, you know, all I can say, you know, uh, deeply from my heart, and certainly Vicky and the families, it's a God thing. Um, the groundswell of support by the many New Zealanders that have been touched by her case. And, and important to also just note that it's not just about Vicky, it's about um, others that were also affected that don't have a voice. But, John, you know, the media is such a powerful tool, and um, when it's used in a proper um, professional way in which you've uh, conducted both, um, you know, the times that you've met with um, the other members of my family and, and myself. Um, yeah, John, look, I just, words can't even describe what you No, I, 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 can, I can well imagine what it must be like to be there and to have heard the news in those circumstances. So, so Vicky knows now she's coming with you, uh, Ulu, we're going to... She's in a pile of mess at the moment of um, joy and happiness. And so we're just um, packing her up and then uh, Mum too is arriving shortly and then we're going to take her home. Well, you enjoy your time with her, Ula. Thank you, John. Thank you, John. Ula Latelli speaking to us just a few minutes ago, an unedited uh, recording of the interview we did with him as we were finding out what went on. Vicky Latelli is heading home. She is going as we speak. Her uncle is there and her mum is coming to collect her as well.